Hi, how is everyone? I hope y'all are all having a fantastic day. Today, I wanted to share with y'all, um, I got my Ipsy regular in the mail and I got the Ipsy, oh, I do that every time, Ipsy plus in the mail as well. And my ultimate should be here within the next day or two. So we're gonna go ahead and do these two together. Um, I do want to remind y'all before I forget that I do still have the giveaway going on. Um, so that winner will be announced as soon as I get my Ipsy Ultimate, I will announce it in that video. So either tomorrow or the next day. So make sure if you are entered to stay tuned for that video. And if you haven't entered, I will link that video down below and you still have a day or two to get entered. So Anyways, we will jump right in. Um, so this is their smallest size bag. This is $12 now, and um, you always get a really cute bag. You get, um, I believe, five travel size samples. Sometimes we get full size. So I've been getting that one for years, and I would probably just, you know, always keep it. So the me medium size is the Ipsy Plus. This one is $25 a month. They are all free shipping. And I believe this one is supposed to be five full size items. And then the Ipsy Ultimate that I was talking about, that one is $50 free shipping. That one is, these are all monthly. Um, you can subscribe to all three or you can pick and choose what you want. So that's what I'm kind of trying to figure out this month, which I want to keep. I'm kind of thinking about the large one and the small one and getting rid of the medium one. But who knows? Um, I do believe that they are, um, you're not supposed to get any repeat items. So if you wanted to get all three, you should be safe there. Also, um, you do get a different size bag in each box as well. So that's pretty neat, you know. Anyways, we will jump right in. And I think we will just go ahead and do the small size bag first. And I had already torn it open. So here is our bag, which I absolutely love, I have to say. I mean, it really just looks like foil, and I love that. And this is my favorite color, this hunter green right here. So that's the zipper, and it's that color on the inside as well. So I think that is really, really pretty. So let's just pull everything out. And we do have our little card here. Um, that gives us information on the products, which I am seeing no prices. If you haven't seen any of my past Ipsy videos, I don't really ever have a problem with the products. I always have a problem with their information cards. Sometimes there's prices, sometimes there's not. I feel like I complain about it all the time and I think other people do as well. So I don't understand why there's not, um, you know, better consistency when it comes to that, but I'm normally pretty happy with the products. So Anyways, okay, so at least we have information, just no prices. So we're gonna start with this. This was on the outside um, of the bag. It obviously would not fit in there. So this is really nicely packaged too, I will say. This is Complex Culture. Um, I guess this is the brand, and let's see, whoops, what the brush itself looks like. That is really, really pretty, and it says right here, all over highlight powder really pretty that is really soft i think it would definitely be the perfect um um consistency or denseness i guess you would want to say if i could get my words together <laughs> so that's the first thing a really nice nice highlighter brush um and that's just what it says complex culture all over highlight powder brush so there's number one the next thing I see is Lip Crush Lip Oil, and this is the brand. I'm just going to say Tipsy. I don't know if that's what they were going for or not, but I would think that would be it, and that smells really good. It has a really sweet smell. Oh, wow. It looks clear. Look at that. It looks clear, but this is what it changed to on my hand. That is really cool, actually. So, let's see. Lip Crush Lip Oil, um, it says, let's see, this December, give your lips the gift of glow with this lip oil. It's deeply moisturizing, has a glossy finish, and leaves behind a warm pink tint that shifts with your lips. So that is really cool. It looks clear, and I mean, it got pretty, pretty pink. So that's neat. 
Next we have from Han Hu. This is Watermelon Illuminator Daytime Facial Oil. And this is a Korean beauty product, which I really, really like. And this is, it says daytime facial oil. It is sealed, so I'm not going to open it. I just have so many things open right now. So there's that, and I do like watermelon, so I will probably love that. And it says, layer it under your go-to sunscreen for added protection from the sun, drying winds, and environmental stressors during the day. Um, it's a go-to for healthy, bright, glowing skin. Um, and it says it absorbs quickly and won't feel greasy. So there's that one. Next we have from Reka, I believe. This is an illuminating turmeric polish and this is a turmeric facial scrub. This is 0 0.507 ounces. And this I know I will like. I love stuff like this. It is sealed as well. So there's the tube and the brand kind of sounds familiar but i'm not just real sure if i've gotten anything from there it says it's yellow it's bright it's so pretty to look at and your skin loves it too turmeric is a do-it-all ingredient found in indian beauty um it is a glow bo boosting face polish made of super fine walnut and oat granules so that is really really neat and um, I guess the theme this month is shine on. So that would be um, very fitting with the theme. Next we have from Tarte. This is High Performance Naturals. And this is their 12-hour blush in um, the shade Kisses. Now, I will say I did know that I was getting this because you got to choose. However, I didn't mean to choose this. I meant to choose the bronzer. And after I already pushed um, Confirm... It was the blush. So I will probably give this away just because I have so, so many blushes. However, it is a very pretty color. And if you can see, it is actually a little shimmery. So I am not too big on um, shimmer blushes because I have really large pores and they really accentuate your pores right here. So I try to go as matte as possible when it comes to blush and bronzers. Um, and that, you know, it just says it's um, a pretty natural looking flush. Um, so, you know, I think, I think most of us have probably used or seen those blushes by now. Anyways, here's the inside of the bag. Really pretty. I'm really loving this bag. So now we will move over to the Ipsy Plus and see what we have in here. I guess I kind of need to cut the tape. All right. Here's the inside, it says discover yourself. And there's everything, if you can see, inside. So we have a card here. Oh, and this one does have prices. So that's awesome. We have product information and prices. That makes me very, very happy. Okay, so the first thing we have is a lip balm. This is um, an organic vanilla lip balm from Noya. I'm not exactly sure if I'm saying that correctly, but there's that. Um, not just real exciting. Let's see. Okay, it's a set of two and it values at $7.98. Oh, here's the other one. I didn't see it. And this one is peppermint. So there's that. Um, you know, lip balm. I, I really feel like we got a lip balm last month in the ultimate as well so i don't know i'll have to look back and see okay now here we have another nice brush this is also from complex culture and this is the press and set bronzer brush this is valued at 35 dollars and i will say their packaging is really really nice and the brushes are really pretty as well i mean look at that that is really, really nice. I love this matte handle. Um, I really love everything about it. It's very soft. I definitely think that would be a good um, bronzer brush, even a powder brush because it's so big. So I will definitely use these. I am really happy about that. And I love it when they come in these little sleeves or sometimes it's the little netting sleeves because after you wash them, you can slide it right back over 
and then it puts your brushes right back how you want them. So I love it when they have those. Um, next, okay, now this is what I picked um, in the choices on this box this month. This is from Evalu. I'm not sure all these names. I don't know if I'm saying them right or not. Um, okay, this is a hydrating serum. This is one ounce exactly, and it says after cleansing and toning, um, or use after cleansing and toning, can be used twice a day and it says you can refrigerate it for best results so there's this i can't remember what the other choices were but that's what i grabbed um and the retail or that's what i picked and the retail on that was 68 dollars. and it says it's a tall glass of water for your thirsty skin so there's that next we have from morphe this is a mega matte lipstick in the shade dominate so that is a very pretty christmas bright red and this will not be a shade i will wear but that is okay that is a really really neat um, tube that it comes in oh how pretty even that's red and there is the shade right there that is really really pretty I have a really good friend that has um, really dark skin and which I think that any and every color looks good on her, but these reds, she can pull them off like nobody's business. So this will definitely be um, a good gift for her. I know she will love that color. And that retails for $9, so that's not bad at all. We have a little palette here. Um, also, I wanted to show y'all, here is the medium size bag, and this one has navy blue as the accent color on the inside and the zipper, so I think that is really neat. Where's the other bag? Just so I can kind of show you the two different. So, this one's just a little bit bigger, and here's the regular size bag, but I gotta say, I am loving this silver foil look, so I'm really happy with the bags. Okay. Last but not least, this is from Itzy, I believe, and this is Build Your Own Palette. Um, it says it's magnetic, and I don't know anything about this brand. It doesn't sound familiar, so let's just see. There's that. It's really pretty. It's like leather. Totally different than what we normally normally get. Um, totally different than what we normally get. This is not what I expected. Um, Okay, so it has a nice mirror, but look at that. A whopping four tiny, tiny shades. So I don't know about that, I guess. Okay, so you can take this out basically, and then I guess you could continue. They all move around, so. Okay, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I, I have a hard time not comparing this to BoxyCharm just because they're the same prices and we've never gotten an eyeshadow palette with only four shadows in BoxyCharm or lip balms. That, I don't like that. I'll be honest with you. Um, I don't mind. I think a lip balm in the $12 bag would be totally fine, but not for this one. So this is, I think this is kind of the reason why I'm considering um, canceling the $25 one and maybe keeping the larger and smaller however i will say the shades are very pretty um this one's going to be your matte and all three of these are shimmers and i'm not going to swatch this because i just know this isn't going to be something i will reach for so i would rather um my mom wears very plain neutral colors she doesn't um, like to play around a lot with eyeshadows so maybe that would be something that she would enjoy and um, i don't mind giving a lot of this stuff away i know i say it a lot but I just feel like as long as it gets used, I'm happy with that. I don't like anything to go to waste or even for giveaways, you know, things like that. As long as it's getting used, I'm okay if it's not my favorite thing in the world. You know, there's no way I could ever use all of this stuff. So, let's see. The retail on that is $60. Darn dollars. So, okay, it says the Ultimate Winter Eyeshadow Squad. Just says it's a versatile combo of matte and shimmery shades. Um... You can mix and match for a smoky eye, powdery soft, buttery texture, blends very easily. Um, and it says it's magnetic, so you can mix, match, and customize. 
obviously, you, and you wouldn't have to just order this brand. If you already have some magnetic eyeshadows, you could always add those in there and make it your own. So I, I just don't, I don't know, $60 for four shades. That's, that's not something I would ever spend. So anyways, I guess that's the fun of, um, you know, these subscription boxes because we only paid 25 bucks for it. So anyways, please comment down below and let me know what you guys think um, about the difference in the boxes, you know, which you think the value is really there. Um, and I do want to show y'all too that lip oil. It really is not showing up as bright pink on camera as what it is on my hand, but I mean, it is just getting pinker and pinker. It matches the box actually. So that is, um, that is kind of cool. So even the little doe foot has turned. So that's something really neat. So anyways, again, um, I will link the giveaway video down below if you have not gotten entered and that will be up within the next day or two, I would say Thursday or Friday of this month, which would be what? I have no idea what today is. 13, 14, 15, 16. Okay, today's the 18th. Yes. So either the 19th or the 20th, um, the giveaway video I will put up. So anyways, thank you so much for watching. Please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed and please subscribe and we'll see you next time. Bye.